Hey everyone, it's Tamoya here and welcome back to another video. Now, as you can see, I have all of these Fungo Pops here and obviously you can see this one. So we're gonna start off with that one. Um, but this is all like the new release Funko Pops that just came out. Honestly, I just got the phone call from GameStop. And yes, GameStop. Um, you guys know the little story between me and GameStop. GameStop and I, we still have these mixed feelings, frenemies, um, relationship. But I decided I'm going to give them another chance to redeem themselves for, you know, still selling some of my figures in the past but like here we are i ordered a bunch of funko pops and i got the phone call two days ago and GameStop was like come get your stuff and i was like okay so here they are and we're going it's like for two three three animes and one thing that's on the side but because they're all in these carton stuff um, I can't really see which one's which, but this one, obviously, you guys can. So, we're going to get started and to see what we have. Okay, we're going to start off with this one because you guys see it already. This is the Exodia, the Forbidden one. This is a big Funko Pop, and it's the first one that I actually have one big one. And I'm not talking about this Naruto Sasuke because that's two, and it's supposed to be a scene. But this is my official really big Funko Pop. Um, and it looks pretty freaking cool, honestly, guys. Like, do you see that? And I'm not trying to open any of them up. So this one is supposed to come with Yugi Moto, not Yami, Yugi, Pegasus, Joey, Red Eyes, and Exodia. And apparently, there is Slifer the Sky Dragon that came out and Obelisk the Tormentor. Um, I haven't seen the Winged Dragon of Raw. But I know it was going to come out soon. I tried to get my hands on that Slither, the Sky Dragon. But you know what? Box Lunch and Hot Topic were like, yeah, we don't have it right now. So I'm like, oh no. But you know what? We're going to keep this Yugi um, Funko Pop collection alive. So I got Exodia. And then if you see right there, I have my Dark Magician. I also have Kaiba, Yami. Um, Blue Eyes and Dark Magician Girl open, so I'm going to try to get them. Um, going to adjust my camera a little bit. Um, unbox. So, here's Exodia. Now let's see, because I haven't opened any of these, so I'm going to just pick one and see what we have. Oh, okay, so this is the one I literally got yesterday from Box Lunch. Okay, so we don't need this part in box. This one is a collab Hello Kitty um, Sanrio um, with My Hero Academia and like I said before I'm not a My Hero Academia fan but I do love the Sanrio collection so this one is I cannot pronounce this name ooh Texudon Sam Todoroki Todoroki okay Mr. Todoroki here um, and it is a box lunch exclusive item, which I got it as like a pre-order and it just finally came in the mail. Um, so, so cute. I mean, and it's supposed to come with all of these in the back. Um, Hello Kitty, uh, Pochaku, that's Maru, My Melody, to Todoroki, Mr. Todoroki here, um, or yeah and kiddo b i butchered the name i am so sorry for all the sanrio i'm more of a hello kitty and my melody fan and sometimes bochaku but i never really bought stuff from them so yeah so here is mr todoroki here and moving on so this is another one oh and i can't read that handwriting so we're just going to and it's red eyes. Why does he look silver blue? That's concerning to me because red eyes is like this black dragon. Hmm. But yeah, here is red eyes black dragon. This is 
a card that Yugi gave to Joey and it's Joey's prized possession. If you have not seen the anime series, you will need to watch it because they explain how this card got into Joey's hands and how it got stolen from him. Um, so yeah, again, I don't know why he's not pitch black like it is in the picture. He looks like my blue eyes. If you see it side by side, they kind of look similar. He's just darker here. My blue eyes is right here. So I, okay, Mac. Um, so I want to know why he's not pitch black, but again, I'm keeping them in the box. So this is blue eyes, no, red eyes, black dragon. Moving on. So let's see. Okay, so I did pre-order a lot of this anime. I'm a big fan of Inuyasha, even though I did not finish the anime because back then when I was actually religiously watching anime and Inuyasha specifically, anime on demand stopped putting up episodes and that's when I kind of stopped and it was really hard to get back into the rhythm because I'm in school, college, all of this stuff and now that I'm working. So once they came out with the Funko Pop versions of the Inuyasha characters, I said yes. I am going to get these. So here is Kagome, the main character here besides Inuyasha. Um, she has her bow and arrow. She looks like she's about to fight, always doing her thing. Um, she is a good character. I actually like her. I don't like Inuyasha too much because I love Sisomaru here. He is my favorite. And if you guys don't know, Sisomaru is Inuyasha's brother. So he yeah, has she's supposed to come with Seishomaru and Inuyasha. Um, and there's another Funko Pop that's coming out with Seishomaru Inuyasha. Kind of like the Naruto mm, the Naruto and Sasuke um, Funko Pop right there. It's a battle scene. Can't wait to get that because I also pre-ordered it. So yeah, she looks really cool. I'm so glad they came out with Inuyasha ones. And I think I got two more. I think I completed the collection here. So let's move on. Okay, boom, going back to Yu-Gi-Oh! And here is Yugi Moto. And again, if you guys have not seen Yu-Gi-Oh!, which that would be very surprising because Yu-Gi-Oh! is one of those animes that you see um, from a very young age without even knowing that you're watching it. Um, but yeah, this is Yugi and with the um, pyramid um the millennium puzzle actually um he can turn into yami and look at yugi he's with his cards even though he never really plays in the show which is funny but he knows how to so that's good um and the last episode made me want to cry so much but yeah so yeah look at him i actually do have yami so yugi and yami you see yami looks like he's about to kill somebody he's ready to duel and his clothes change a little bit. Like, Yugi is in, like, this light color blue. Not really, but you know, school uniform. And for Yami, they made it so much darker. <laughs> I don't know why. But, yeah. So, again, unbox. I'm going to get them box soon. But, look at that. So cute. And here we go with Inuyasha. All right, so we have now Kagome and Inuyasha. These are the two lovebirds in the show. However, Kikyo is in the way. Kikyo's in the way. And she, Kagome actually looks very similar to Kikyo. I'm not a big fan of Kikyo. But you know what? I like Kagome more than Kikyo and Inuyasha here. See if we can see his sword. Mm, yeah. It's in the back. If you can see that fur over there. In the back. He looks pretty cool. I love that they gave him like pitch white. Like a white. Like whiter than this shirt white. Okay. By the way. New color. No more black for today. Alright. Um, but yeah. Look at this. What's this one? There we go. And here's my baby Sashomaru. I love Sashomaru so much. He's that cool side character that's also looking for the crystals. Um, 
Yeah, he is full demon while Inuyasha is f half human, half demon. Um, so Shinobu doesn't like Inuyasha that much. What a surprise. He reminds me of Sasuke, but I saw them simultaneously at the same time. So I can't say which one. But so Shinobu doesn't let his emotions get to him while Sasuke does a little bit. A little bit. A little bit. Love them both. Um, but yeah, here is the trio for this. And I'm missing that big one, which we will get soon. Last but not least, the last anime is the Dragon Ball Super. And it's Vegeta in his I'm ready to be a dad clothes. I'm ready to see Bulma give birth. <laughs> um, I love Vegeta always love him so much um yeah and he's supposed to come with a couple of people so he's supposed to come with hercule gohan um super saiyan kale super saiyan khalifa and future mai which i kind of want to get mai and gohan because gohan looks kind of cool here um but and mai i specifically want her um but yeah so i'm still waiting on a few more uh, Funko, so stay tuned for that. Well, that's the collection. Oh, and if you guys were curious, here's my Kaiba. Oh, 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 she fell out. And my Dark Magician girl. So, yeah, gotta get them boxed. But, yeah, so here is the full collection that I got very excited i really wish i got all of them at once but you know what life is life um so yeah oh gosh this screen is going to these are gonna fall so i'm better not okay so that's all i have for you guys for this week's video i am so glad that I was able to show you guys this Funko haul. I'm going to have another one soon because again, I hadn't I didn't get all the Funkos that I ordered. And there is a Baruto Sasuke out there, so I'm going to get that one too. Um, so yeah, this is all I have for you guys for the, today's video. I hope you enjoy it. Please give it a like. Comment down below which one was your favorite out of this whole thing. And share this video subscribe i make new videos every sunday and we're almost at 200 subscribers so we're going to want to have that giveaway soon and if you want to follow all my other social media accounts the links will be in the description below and i will see you all next sunday look at all these phone calls we are going to be out bye guys